First things first, congratulations to the four winners this week. Golf clap. Golf clap. All right, that's enough. Pop quiz, what's worse? Losing in fantasy football? Or this? Oh, here's a fun fact. You made out with your sister, man! You were right, the obvious answer is fantasy football. But let us think more deeply about it. Okay, fine, I'm, I'll give it a rest. <sighs> Jamie, can I borrow your fromers? Oh, here's a fun fact. You made out with your sister, man! Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! Nope, nope. The answer is still fantasy football. And now a message from a famous celebrity. We've gone over this before. The Department of Homeland Security, uh, they're getting rid of their color-coded terror alert system that we've been kind of getting used to. They're replacing it with a new system based on the films of Nicolas Cage. <laughs> because our nation's security is a lot like Nick Cage movies. Most of the time, things are okay. But every once in a while, things are so awful, you can't believe it. <laughs> Depending on the threat level, Americans will be notified with a very short clip from a Nick Cage movie. Here are the latest examples. When everything's fine, the threat level will be named after Cage's action film, Next. <laughs> now, that means everything's fine. If something's slightly amiss, the threat level will be described as Vampire's Kiss. <laughs> when things start to seem really bad, we set the alert level at matchstick men. This is an emergency. Hey, buddy, ever heard of a lie? Hey, have you ever been dragged to the sidewalk and being tell you, pissed blood? <laughs> and if things get to a point where they're just really, really getting bad, we set the alert to Zandali. <laughs> And let's hope and pray <laughs> that in our lifetimes, we never experience the ultimate threat level, deadfall. Oscars for I that know. scene alone.